President Biden has introduced the first image to be shown publicly from the James Webb Telescope. The vast depths beneath our oceans conceal mysteries beyond our wildest imaginations. Enigmatic remnants of history, lost cities, and eerie signs of things once alive lurk below the surface, waiting to be uncovered. But amid the allure of discovery, there's a tinge of unease. What if these submerged secrets weren't meant to be found? Dive in with us as we delve deep to unveil 15 underwater discoveries that have left even the bravest explorers trembling. Prepare to be both enthralled and terrified. The Christmas launch of the James Webb Space Telescope in 2021 was truly a remarkable event. It soared into the sky riding atop a powerful European Ariane 5 rocket. The launch site was amidst the lush forests of South America, adding a touch of nature's grandeur to this colossal event. Thousands of scientists from around the globe had poured their collective expertise and effort into this project for three decades, culminating in this momentous achievement. However, such grand endeavors come with enormous risks, and the possibility of failure loomed like a shadow throughout. Miraculously, everything unfolded with near-perfect precision. The telescope embarked on a journey spanning nearly a million miles, enduring 30 days of travel through the void of space. Its ultimate destination was the enigmatic Lagrange Point 2, a place in space where gravity maintains a delicate equilibrium, opposite to the Sun in relation to Earth's orbit. This spot had already become home to other space telescopes like the Hubble Space Telescope and the Planck Space Observatory. It was an ideal vantage point for the James Webb Telescope to begin its cosmic voyage. As the James Webb Space Telescope embarked on its cosmic journey, NASA unveiled its ambitious agenda, outlining four primary realms of exploration. First and foremost, the telescope aimed to witness the universe's inaugural burst of light, a crucial juncture in the cosmic genesis. It sought to probe the ancient celestial past, laying bare the enigmatic assembly of galaxies during the universe's nascent stages. But beyond this cosmic archaeology, the JWST was likewise poised to unveil celestial spectacles of the utmost significance. It yearned to peer into the cradles of stellar birth, shedding light on the genesis of stars and the formation of protoplanetary systems. Moreover, its quest extended to the panorama of planets, delving into the grand narrative of planetary existence, including the elusive origins of life itself. These scientific frontiers had long eluded comprehensive exploration due to the inherent challenges of scrutinizing the universe. Before embarking on its celestial observations, the JWST underwent a meticulous series of scientific tests and calibration procedures. Among these, an all-important examination involved the deployment of a remarkable protective shield designed to safeguard the telescope's delicate instruments from the relentless onslaught of the sun's heat and blinding radiance. Given the telescope's perpetual voyage through the cosmic void, this safeguard was nothing short of imperative. The sun shield, one gigantic construct composed of five strictly layered membranes, had been carefully folded, similar to a complex accordion. The unfolding process demanded a precise choreography of unfolding steps, each calibrated to ensure proper tension and alignment of every layer. The stakes were massive, as any misalignment or harm to this cosmic guardian could damage the telescope's capacity to observe the distant, enigmatic realms of the universe. With relief, it sailed through the initial test, setting its course for the next challenge. The upcoming task was to open up the telescope, another highly delicate procedure. Even though it was already precisely positioned, it needed to prepare itself meticulously to fulfill its cosmic duties. At the heart of the JWST lay its primary mirror, an intricate mosaic of 18 hexagonal pieces that demanded perfect synchronization to craft sharp celestial portraits. The prepping of the JWST was a ballet of complexity and fragility, entailing not just the unfolding of its colossal sun shield, but also the graceful extension of its support structure and the gradual unveiling of its primary mirror. However, the mirror's revelation marked merely the start of the artistry. Every element had to align flawlessly to enable the JWST to fulfill its scientific quest. Another intricate calibration test involved awakening Webb's scientific instruments one by one, as if rousing dormant senses. These instruments included the near-infrared camera, the near-infrared spectrograph, and the mid-infrared instrument. 
Each of them possessed unique talents for gazing upon the universe, adding layers of intrigue to the mission. Equally, the telescope had to define its cosmic bearings, a process known as commissioning. This involved engaging the telescope in studying calibration markers and refining its aim, ensuring that its instruments are locked onto the celestial targets with pinpoint precision. All these trials were the guardians at the gate, guaranteeing that Webb was primed and prepared to embark on its odyssey and uncover yet unknown secrets of our universe. As these intricate procedures unfolded, a sense of anticipation swept through the scientific community. Everyone held their breath, hoping for success and knowing fully well that in the world of science, things often don't go as planned. To everyone's astonishment, the JWST sailed through every test flawlessly, an achievement that's nothing short of astounding. This monumental project brought together more than 300 universities, organizations, and companies from 29 U.S. states and 14 different countries. Then, in July 2022, after enduring and conquering every challenge NASA threw its way, the James Webb Space Telescope received the green light to embark on its remarkable scientific voyage. NASA proudly announced that all 17 of the observatory's scientific instrument modes had undergone rigorous scrutiny and were now deemed ready for action. Like any other telescope, the JWST's primary purpose is to collect and focus light, revealing distant celestial wonders. However, what makes the JWST exceptional is the specific slice of the electromagnetic spectrum it observes. While our human eyes are limited to perceiving visible light, the JWST sees beyond into a hidden realm of cosmic phenomena. It's a profound shift in perspective, opening new horizons in our quest for understanding the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope is like a cosmic heat seeker, similar to a futuristic night vision camera that's capable of gazing into the universe's depths. But on a grand scale, its enormous size allows it to gather more light than any other telescope, letting it peer at even tinier more distant celestial wonders. But here's the best part. It's stationed up in space, free from those pesky atmospheric roadblocks that often blur our view. That's why they call it the universe's watchful eye. But how does this marvel actually work? At its core, it boasts a colossal 21-ton mirror. This giant mirror grabs and bounces light back to the telescope's intricate instruments. And speaking of instruments, the JWST packs A quartet of them, each with its unique cosmic talent. First up, we've got the near-infrared camera, the JWST's main eye. This high-tech lens captures breathtaking images of far-off galaxies, nebulae, and other celestial marvels. Next in line is the near-infrared spectrograph. It's like a cosmic prism, breaking down light into its rainbow hues, revealing secrets about the objects it observes. Then there's the mid-infrared instrument, specially tailored to scoop up infrared light. It delves into the mysteries of the early universe, explores exoplanets, and even takes a closer look at our own solar system. Finally, there's the fine guidance sensor near infrared imager and slitless spectrograph. These high-precision tools ensure the JWST points in the right direction and is extra sensitive to near-infrared light. With this combo, it leaves no cosmic stone unturned. Now, the real magic lies in understanding the expanding universe. As the universe stretches and grows, light from distant corners of space gets redshifted. This means the light's wavelengths get stretched out, making it appear redder than its original form. By observing the universe in this redshifted light, we can literally peer back in time, seeing the universe as it was in its early days. Imagine witnessing the birth of stars and galaxies and learning about the ancient conditions of our universe. The James Webb Space Telescope possesses a remarkable ability to gaze deep into the universe, a feat that essentially lets it peer back in time. The farther an object is from us, the longer its light takes to reach our telescopes. Consequently, when JWST focuses its lenses on a distant galaxy, it isn't merely capturing a snapshot of the present. Instead, it's like a cosmic time machine revealing what that galaxy looked like billions of years ago when its light embarked on its interstellar voyage. This unique capability allows scientists to delve into the ancient history of our universe, a time when the first stars and galaxies were taking shape, providing an invaluable opportunity to study the processes that sculpted the universe we now behold. 
The capabilities of the JWSD made their grand entrance into the public eye on July 12, 2022, following NASA's unveiling of its inaugural batch of scientific imagery during a live event. These pictures were nothing short of breathtaking. Imagine staring at the cosmic cliffs within the Carina Nebula or gazing upon the ethereal beauty of the Southern Ring Nebula. These were more than just pretty pictures. They were windows into the vastness of space and time. But that's not all. The telescope equally went beyond aesthetics, diving into the scientific nitty-gritty. It analyzed the composition of the atmosphere of the scorching gas giant exoplanet WASP 96b, offering critical insights into alien worlds. Additionally, it presented us with a captivating view of Stefan's Quintet, a group of galaxies locked in a mesmerizing celestial dance as they merge and mingle. These images didn't just elicit excitement because of their visual splendor, though that was undeniable. They sparked enthusiasm because of the profound scientific revelations they brought. But it was as far back as February 2022 that NASA first offered the world a glimpse into the JWST's shocking capabilities. This was when NASA announced Webb's inaugural glimpse of starlight. The image, a mosaic composed of 18 scattered luminous dots, featured the prominent star HD 84406. Thomas Zerbichin, NASA's Associate Administrator for the Science Mission Directorate, excitedly tweeted that as the Webb honed its focus, these 18 celestial beacons would seamlessly merge into a solitary radiant star. This achievement marked a thrilling milestone illustrating the telescope's immense potential for future discoveries and interstellar explorations. In the following weeks, Webb continued its odyssey of progress. On February 18, NASA unveiled an upgraded image of HD 84406, where the 18 dispersed star copies had been carefully arranged into a mesmerizing hexagonal formation. This gave us a tantalizing glimpse of the eventual grandeur that awaited once the observatory precisely aligned the individual segments of its primary mirror, ushering in the era of image stacking that promised to unlock even more cosmic wonders. Webb didn't shy away from taking a daring selfie. Using a high-tech camera nestled within the NIR cam instrument, this camera, initially meant for technical tasks like engineering and calibration, captured a stunning image. In it, one mirror segment outshone the rest, gleaming with a radiance born of perfect alignment and an unwavering focus on a distant star. Gradually, each mirror segment fell into place, revealing the telescope's breathtaking precision and unwavering accuracy. However, Webb's real showstopper came when it cast its gaze deeper into the Eagle Nebula. Towering columns of gas and dust reached out into the boundless universe like colossal sentinels guarding the secrets of the universe. The Hubble Space Telescope, known for its incredible visual prowess, captured a similar stunning beauty of these celestial formations, yet it could only show the surface, leaving the enigmatic secrets hidden within untouched. Here's where the James Webb Space Telescope takes center stage. Its extraordinary infrared imaging technology went further to unravel the clandestine processes at play within the pillars of creation in the Eagle Nebula. In Webb's latest image, a mesmerizing scene unfolds. Countless protostars emerge like crimson pinpricks against the smoky backdrop of the towering pillars. These massive collections of dust and gas, each dwarfing our entire solar system, serve as the cosmic cradles for newborn stars. These youthful stars, as captured in the image, are still in their infancy, not yet ignited by the fusion of hydrogen. According to Derek Ward-Thompson, the distinguished head of the School of Natural Sciences at the University of Central Lancashire in the UK, they patiently gather material over time, growing denser and denser in the core. Suddenly, a transformative moment arrives when the hydrogen ignition flickers to life and their temperatures soar to a scorching 2 million degrees Celsius. The image itself is a masterpiece, employing a vibrant palette of colors to depict the mostly invisible realm of infrared wavelengths. It's a vivid glimpse into the hidden wonders of the universe unveiled by the James Webb Space Telescope's extraordinary capabilities. Anand Kokor, an astronomy researcher at the Space Telescope Science Institute in Baltimore, skillfully assembled this captivating image using data from the Webb Telescope. He revealed a fascinating aspect of the image, stating that although it appears entirely blue to our eyes, these parts would actually look radiant red when viewed without specialized equipment. 
This stunning phenomenon occurs because as the wavelengths of radiation increase, the colors shift toward the red end of the spectrum. In this image, the protostars emit radiation with wavelengths roughly six times longer than what the human eye can perceive. This intriguing aspect isn't merely about visual aesthetics. It holds valuable insights into the formation of stars, including our own Sunday images like this not only showcase Webb's prowess as an infrared telescope, as noted by Ward Thompson, but they also offer us a unique window into the early stages of star formation and its evolution over time. Yet, as mesmerizing as stars are, one enigma still remains unresolved. The direct imaging of exoplanets. Back in the early 1990s, scientists embarked on a journey that would forever alter our understanding of the universe. They embarked on a quest to unveil the secrets of distant stars by discovering exoplanets, celestial bodies that orbit those far-off suns. A subtle but brilliant technique, monitoring the faint dimming of a star's radiance as an exoplanet gracefully crossed its path. Fast forward to the present moment, and a game-changing era is now upon us. Following Webb's successful launch and commissioning, this technological marvel brought with it an unprecedented level of sensitivity and an array of advanced instruments. Within a mere year of its maiden voyage, it etched its name in the annals of space exploration. The first exoplanet to be directly imaged by Webb was none other than HIP 65426b, a colossal gas giant discovered in 2017. The astonishing feat lay in the exoplanet's location, distant, almost unimaginable, sitting a staggering 100 times farther from its host star than Earth dances around the Sun. This monumental achievement required the coordinated efforts of Webb's two trusty cameras, along with an assortment of filters. The resulting images were carefully merged to fashion a composite portrait that left astronomers in awe. The exoplanet's portrait unveiled its grandeur, a stunning breakthrough that left astronomers spellbound. What makes this exoplanet truly stand out among its celestial peers is its sheer size. A behemoth among giants, it tips the scales at roughly 12 times the girth of Jupiter, Earth's magnificent neighbor in the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope's enormous size, along with its far position from its host star, allows it to easily capture these astonishing images. Yet, its mission extends beyond just creating captivating visuals. Through these images, we gain glimpses into the intricate process of planet formation and the intriguing variety of atmospheres they possess. Such insights offer hope in our quest to uncover exoplanets with environments conducive to life, a pursuit that has spanned decades with discouraging results. However, the James Webb Space Telescope's unique ability to approach planets closely raises our optimism. Webb has successfully observed the most ancient galaxies known to humanity, galaxies that came into being when the universe itself was but a cosmic infant, merely 2% of its current age. These four galaxies stand as the most distant celestial bodies ever beheld, residing at an astonishing distance of approximately 13.4 billion light years away from us. Imagine this for a moment. The light we now see from these galaxies embarked on its journey 13.4 billion years ago, crossing a vast cosmic expanse to finally reach our telescopes. The sheer magnitude of this distance is almost beyond comprehension. Yet, Webb has accomplished something truly remarkable. It has peered back in time, capturing vivid images of these galaxies as they existed over 13 billion years ago. This extraordinary feat of observation was no small undertaking. Scientists faced the daunting challenge of initially identifying these galaxies, a task made all the more formidable by their staggering distance from us. But thanks to Webb's extraordinary infrared capabilities, it managed to detect even the faintest signals emanating from these ancient celestial objects. As part of the JWS Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey, researchers succeeded in singling out four galaxies from the Cosmic H, 